Uh, we are back with another question from uh, users uh, in YouTube. Uh, in this uh, example, we perform the operation access bits in an integer by uh, doing uh, or overlaying tags. So the user asks us if it's possible to do the same in tier portal for S7300. So uh, it's possible. So I need to move to the sketching board to do uh, a bit explanation on the concept. So uh, the sketching board, we have an integer. Uh, the name of integer is integer one. The data type is integer and uh, this integer, uh, let me, integer mm, variable has uh, 16 uh, bits and uh, we want to as an as an uh, example here we have an fc and uh, this in this fc the input of uh, uh, this fc is the uh, variable we can say integer one we want to uh, feed this integer one to another variable uh, as an example ein that is also integer and by using a, a simple uh, ein is in temp var in temp area temp so in temp area by using a simple uh, line of declaration uh, we are able to we are able to do the bitwise access test is the name of a new variable so AT is the keyboard here and the name of old variable here the integer in temp is the I N and the array zero up to 15 of boolean so by doing this declaration simply you have access to all of those uh, variables here if this is the bit number zero two three two uh, zero one two three four simply if you just uh, fetch test zero you're accessing to the first test one test two very simple similar to the um, array concept so uh, in, this is the way to access uh, um, a smaller uh, component in a big a bigger data type we uh, just discuss how to uh, split uh, an integer. Uh, there, uh, there is a possibility to uh, split uh, date and time, date and time, date and time as uh, mm, eight bytes. Uh, and the date and type data are encoded into this eight byte. Um, format so if you want to have the access to uh, each element data and type you can use this uh, syntax and also a and by pointer uh, we can do the same in uh, STL but in STL we have uh, more 
low level uh, low level tools in that indirect addressing uh, low level tools to have access to uh, individual memory area in uh, local or even in the uh, the data in the uh, instance data block uh, for uh, calling in a, a function block. So um, we want to implement this concept into a portal very easily. I uh, move to the to a portal and do the rest of the task there. So we are back into the tier portal in tier portal we create a new project s7 300 project any hardware that is suitable for your for your test and uh, here uh, mm, i can simply add uh, a power supply And let me compile, compile it here. The password, so yeah, for this test, uh, mm, okay. Uh, let us uh, move and create a mm, function. So we need a function in SCL. Uh, so in this function, we have the input. This is the uh, integer uh, input, and uh, we have uh, some outputs like uh, output one as boolean, output two, output three. Let me copy. Output two, output three, output four, and the rest. We want to convert the um, subpart of the integer into the uh, binary. So uh, the ion is uh, integer in temp area and test. So, uh, this part is done. We need to copy first. Input should be copied uh, here. Input is copied to this temporary area, and uh, eventually uh, the output one will be the uh the first uh, the element the first element of the array so what happened we by using this syntax by using this syntax the copy of integer one is entered to ein ein is also uh, split into arrays of uh, 16 elements so we copy each element to one output control C output that will be output two one Output four also. So 
So uh, let me save and compile. So um, everything is uh, working, and I go to the main OB, assign memories here, M word 100, M20, uh, M201, M200, two and m203 that's all save the program compile and uh, to do the function test here so we'll do the function test uh, And download. Run the CPU here. And uh, let's see if we have any trouble. So everything is running smoothly without any trouble here. Uh, let me go to the watch table M100, M100. Let me just have a bunch of these memories here. This is the input. And M200. Out, out. M200, M200. Zero, four bits. Okay. Uh, let us go online. Let me change the first variable. So the first variable is mapped to the first output variable. Let me change the uh, variable number four, bit number four in input, bit number four in output is changing, bit number three the same and bit number two so let me make bit number three zero make it zero here and let's see what uh, what will change so bit number three is changing now very simple you can uh, do the other function tests very simple syntax remember that the same feature is available in stl simply by accessing the uh, somehow memories here we are working purely on uh, symbols physical memories I mean so I stop the video here and thank you for